Let's take this right here and boom it. You can't boom like that, you stupid idiot. Come on! Welcome back, everybody. Some fat rogue cynics. Welcome back. Really. I'm glad you came back to watch this video. Let me know what you think of it in the comments below. Alright, before we get into it. Thank you for your support. It means a lot to the old fat rogue Sarah Dixon. When you boom on that like button, if this is your first time here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It won't hurt and it won't bite. Now, we are exploring some secret that we just figured out. And we're going to go poke around and see what we can find. We'll probably get killed, step right into a trap or something. You never know. Where's it? What's this? A water bucket and a... Chitten, chitten, cotton. Excuse me. Where does this go? This. What? Where are we at now? Oh, wow. So it comes out here. Let's go back in there. That's just weird. Turn my torch back on. What's this button? Journal. So there's an update in the journal. Alright, nice to know that there's a secret that goes to that. That's, that's good to know. We're not going to steal from these guys yet. Adi, adi. Is there anything in these that we can take? Uh, nothing that we want. How about you? I, I took that for some reason. I don't really know why. Why is this one black? What do we feel? Oh, I guess it's all. Why? Well, yeah. How about it, priesty boy? In front of me stands an old priest. His garments are different from other priests. He must be the high priest of the church. Let's see, I need your blessings. I'm seeking the blessing of divine beings. Wow. Let's try that one. My health has increased. Where, where are you going? Really? Well, you know, I'll take that. Look at all that cheese. I don't want your cheese. I don't want your cheese, there, high priest. I do want to see what's in here, though. A piece of exquisite cheese, it says. Well, we'll take that. I mean, it won't hurt to take that. I mean, exquisite. Look, there's a, there's a white bag. I think the white bags you can take. Oh, that says something about Hain. We'll have to check that. Alright, let's see what that says about Hain. I think that's the name of the priest in the other one. I wonder what happened to Father Hain. He disappeared during the rebel attack. He was the one who brought me up. His disciplinary methods were sometimes harsh, but they were effective. I was a difficult child, but his teachings showed me the right way. Huh. Come on back, Malvin. I want to talk to you. Where are you going? Where are you going? Get back out here. Alright. I see cleansing power, see cleansing. I already got your blessing. I am seeking the blessings of the gods. My health has increased. Uh, how are things, Father? It's a fine day, isn't it, dear son? I haven't seen your face before. I welcome you to church. I'm looking for work. You could help me in something. I expect that this is a rather sensitive case. Can I trust you in such a matter? I will handle this delicately, Father. You can trust me. Lately, I've been hearing, well, noises. How can I say this to you, son? Noises, noises of pleasure, I assume. Noises of great pleasure. I'm sorry, Father, but I don't understand. Can you be more specific? 
you know, when a woman and a man, I understand now, Father, this kind of activity is banned among our members, but what makes it matters worse is I strongly suspect the women involved are, you know, working. What do I need to do, Father? I got it all planned out. Listen carefully. Tell my brothers that you have heard that there were rumors about newborns without fathers. Are you, and you are really scared because you have been to the brothel a few times. One of the children might be yours. Ask him, ask them what to do. I think that will scare them enough. What do you think? Sounds like a good plan, father. Now, you don't have to speak to the girls. Simply tell my little story to my brothers, all right? What will I get in return? I will teach you what I have learned over the years. I know quite a few spells, you know. What do you say? I will talk to them, Father. Thank you, my son. Now off you go. All right. There we go. All right, so now we got to go down there and talk to these fellas that's been sneaking out. We all know they've been sneaking out through this secret door down here. Can I talk to you, Father? Sure, son. What bothers your soul? I have to confess, Father. I've been to the brothel. The man's eyes are open wide, and they remain without blinking for many seconds. If one finds out, if one finds himself in a situation like this, one, one should do the honorable thing and bring up the child. Thank you, Father. I will do what I have to. And what about you, Zachary? I guess that's the end of that. I guess that's the end of that. Let's go see what the father says here. Oh, he's so hard to talk to. You shouldn't worry anymore, father. Your brothers will end the relationship with the brothel. Thank you, my son. My heart is free of worry now. As I promised you, I will teach you the knowledge I have attained for many years. I would like to learn. Lower threat. Always oh, the accumulated threat to the value. Heal level one. Uh, yeah, those aren't going to happen. I can't learn them dire heal spells. I ain't smart enough. Alright, so here we go. Head back on into town. We'll pick up this piece of... Uh, I'm so glad this, this this game picked up with another town. I'm telling you, I was so worried that I was going to be stuck forever. Hi, Queenie. Where are you going? A young girl cleaning near the church. She has a simple but good look. She doesn't seem to notice me. Well, that's good. She shouldn't notice me. There's a snake in this house. This house is a mess. She's a level 6 snake, too. Maybe we ought to save it before we go in there. Boom. Yeah, I know which one it was. Boom. Let's do this one. Boom. Let's do this one. Boom. This snake ain't, this dog ain't helping at all. Come on, Jack, boy, get busy with it. It's gonna go splat, you know? Oh, wow. Come on. Oh my goodness, we're gonna take a healing potion. Let's see if we can get a crit off on this stupid snake. I mean, come on, a snake's not that tough. And I, and I hear a mouse somewhere. Come on. Oh, I killed the wrong one. That's no good. That's no good at all. Maybe I'll get more XP out of it, though. You think I'll get more XP out of it? What do you guys think? You think I'll get more XP out of it? Probably not. I don't think so either. I keep missing the snake. It's making me mad. Let's take us a potion here. We don't. We don't want to get too badly sick here. You see that? 
You see that? What's that say right there? Target has dodged for two turns. He didn't dodge that, did he? That, that was almost dangerous. Let's take this right here and boom it. You can't boom like that, you stupid idiot. Come on! Finally, good grief. All that for a little snake skin. All right, let's see what's in here. Hello? Darkwood. An empty jar. An ash ambrosia. A rotten pear. Centipede cotton. We'll leave that in there, I guess. Actually, let's throw this away and get that in there. There we go. Anything else in here? Lootable? Yeah, there's some stuff down here. You ain't gotta kill rats, see. I done figured this out, see. You don't gotta kill the rats. Let's go over here and get us a drink. That was a tough fight. Alright, so, is there anybody here we can talk to? Or Rob? How about it, Queen? What you got in this room back here? Anything good? An emperor fish, huh? What's in this chest? Nope. One, two, three, nothing. Mm. Well, yeah. she ain't got nothing, bless her heart. I got a feeling there's another snake in there somewhere. We're gonna go look, though. Might as well. And they in there, an empty bottle. We're looking for anything that'll point us to the right direction of what we need. A larva, huh? I hate these stupid things. I've got nowhere to go. Why are you attacking me? Rat, huh? Wow, I'm dying quick. I'm like seven critters in there. Screw that. See if we can get something going here. Why do they attack you think? Don't understand why they attack you. Drink us another potion. Close. That was real close. And it ain't over yet. Good grief. Let's see. Let's get us a bite to eat. That'll help. Let's go in here and see what we can steal. While we wait. Unku fish. Nothing in there. 
Somebody's booze. She must be a boozer. Bless her heart. Alright, so we killed that. We killed that. We're still poisoned for whatever reason. Let's go see what's up here. Xander. Xander? Xander or Xander? He looks like he knows what he's talking about. Let's go say, say hello to him. We'll say, hello. Where'd he go? Before we do that, let's save it. Save it over its dark. Boom. I see a large man standing in front of me. We must have, he must have a high position with the rebels. His armor is different form. The rebel, other rebels. Form, that's a misspell, I'm pretty sure. He doesn't like the fact that I'm staring at him. You have a nice home. Indeed, stranger, the house belonged to a fat nobles. It was child's play to scare them away, but that was many years ago. Do you know what happened to them? No idea. I don't really care. I don't care, really. They deserve to experience a hard life. Why? The people hate us for invading your lands. But we deserve to be in charge. You're... Your kind's king banished us to die. Banished you. When the people of the city decided to hide underground, they knew there was not enough space down there. Of course, only the ones who were wealthy enough made the list. Our poor peasant ancestors were left behind to burn. The mad god started to burn up Balram. He summoned meteors and inserted people's homes just for fun. At the time, the council decided to move the city underground. Where was the city that the Mad God destroyed? The city was built centuries ago in Darkwood. Legends say that the forest reclaimed the ruins of the city. There is nothing left of it. Only underground city remain as a reminder of what happened. I'll be on my way. Hmm. Didn't we get a letter about Darkwood that we didn't read? Yeah. For the dark rituals, they chose dark wood. The woods hid the horrible things they did. There you go. There you go. More talking. If he would leave, we'd rob him blind. I guess we could just wait till dark. Let's save it and see if we can get it, see, see if it's worth it. Boom. 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 Right. Left. 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 Right. Right. Left. Right. Left. It is not really worth it. 2831. Alright, so we're gonna load it. Load. It's dark. Boom. So it wasn't worth it. I mean, it's cool to see, but it's not worth it. What we got up here? Some more ruined homes. Hmm. We need to find some blacksmith. Where's this person at? They out hunting or something? I have old sheep spirit. Anything in these? Flower. What's in this one? Oh. Right. Nope. Left. Right, left, left, left. Some fancy pants, we'll take them. Hey, it's a forge. Huh. Alright, so let's look at these fancy pants. 16112. 1611. I think we'll switch to these. Boom. There we go. There we go. Starting to look sharp now. I wonder if this is the blacksmith. There's some kind of flag floating up there. 
Let's go down here. Let's go talk to Fitzy Fitz. Xander tried to kill. He, he said we needed to die. Wasn't that rude? But the king did do an awful thing. Hi, Fitz. He looks like he's having a bad day. He's probably a member of the rebels. I shouldn't make him angry. Why not? I mean, why not? Gonna be a cry baby about it. Where we at here? So we got a moat, and that must be the castle. So we need to go down here to Erdal. That must be like a castle or something in the center there. That's all right. We'll make our way down. Is this Edda? Edda May? How many of you get that reference, huh? How many of you got that reference? Ghost another house, man. Mm. Oh, it's just a Oh, that's that's the one we ran from all ago. Get in there. Took everything we could, right? It's another dirt paw. What's in here? Mm. Rotten cheese. What's in there? A bandit's bail. Mocked us. Alright, so now we can go back over here. Let's make our way back over here. There's a farm right there. Uh, Erdal, it says. We must have made it to Erdal. Let's go up here and talk to this, this girl. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Is it getting dark? Everybody going home? Yo, Perry! Wait up, Perry! I thought... I like, I need, yeah, fix all my stuff. Well, you got to sell, buddy. What's that? A light sword. Huh. Fine broadsword. 225 to 260. A legion helmet. Judgment leggings. Oh, those are nice. But I don't use block. Banded male. Banded male predator. Huh. Maybe I can sell you something. Let's sell you that. Uh. Let's sell you this. He's got a lot of money. We might want to hang on to his, his stuff. He's got a lot of money. See if we can't sell him some stuff. Am I missing anything in there? What about here? Here? Let's sell you this, this bow right here. And then we'll sell you this, and this, and this, and this. Uh, we need that, so let's sell that. We buy my armor? Oh, yeah. Don't want that. We'll keep those for backup. I haven't checked that yet. That's our backup. Actually, it ain't neither. Let's get rid of it. And we'll get rid of this warrior shield. Uh, we'll get rid of that. Uh, we'll get rid of the royal guard boots. I want to keep that. Nitrous guard. Ritual breastplate. Dark Iron Guard, a Gothic Helmet, Cold Protection, Rusty Oak. We'll keep that. An Ash Helmet, Cold Wrist Guard, Worn Leggings, Worn Robe, Priest Robe, Worn Necklace, Servant of Atticus. We gotta keep that. Dark ritual robes, worn shoes, cold gauntlets. I'll hold on to that. Uh, we don't need three pair of rusty gloves. We'll get rid of these paladin boots. We don't need two of these. We'll keep one of those. Is that one on? Yeah. We'll keep one of those. Oh, it looks like we have two pair of greaves too. So let's get rid of the 
Bloody iron boots. I'm gonna keep that for some reason. Uh, let's get rid of that. Boom! That was awesome. That was truly awesome. All right, what else can we sell? So this. So this. So that. This is awesome. We took like all your money, dude. Good chunk of it anyway. It's beautiful. Are you going to bed? Well, how about you, Dale? Dale, don't talk. Ivo, you look like a blacksmith. Are you a blacksmith? Ivo, what are you making here? Don't tell me you need more. I simply can't make enough for you. You have to wait. I'm not here for anything. I'm just looking for work. Then you are not one of them. The rebels take away all my bottles. They sometimes even take whole cask of my good old spirit. You are looking for work. You say, fine, I have something for you. I'm not one of them. What do you need? I'm looking for something new. A new taste for my new creation. I've been making the same spirit for decades. Now it's time for a new one. Bring me all kinds of ingredients. I'll examine them, taste them, and decide what to use. All right, I'll be back with a few ingredients. I brought you ingredients, Ivo. It's a special powder. He smells and tastes each of the ingredients he thinks might be master. He closes his eyes, breathes deeply. I think we may have something here, young man. This powder is extraordinary. I'll certainly try it. Where did you find it? It comes from the wings of the giant moth. Interesting. A giant moth, you say? That won't be easy to obtain. Thank you for your help. Here, take a bottle of my oldest spirit. You earned it. Also, let me tell you a secret of my trade. The secret is to age the spirit in these special casts you see around here. And the bigger secret is that one, the one I gave the rebels is only aged for a few weeks. The bloody idiots are not sophisticated enough to taste the difference. I've had to add some color to the product because to get this wonderful dark red color, one has to age the spirit for years. One day, I will try to give them one without adding color. They might be stupid enough not to notice. Take care, Ivo. Take care, buddy. You just take care. Little feller. Alright, guys, we're gonna sneak down here. Go in this, in Dale's house right here since he don't want to talk to us. Shh, we're in the dark. And we'll rob him blind. We'll take everything we can. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, guys, I think we're gonna call it right there. This has been the Fat Rogue Saturday Next. Now I want you to enjoy your day, enjoy your life, and keep on gaming, y'all. And may God bless.